I'm back with another video and it will be my update on my June TBR and a review of The Shock of the Fall by Nathan Filer. So in terms of TBR, I've done quite well. I've re I've re <laughs> I have read six out of the ten books that I set out to read in the month of June, which are The City of Heavenly Fire by Cassandra Clare, Shatter Me by Tahira Moffey, Where There's Smoke by Jodie Pickled, I swapped A Tale of Two Cities for The Wind in the Willows by Kenneth Graham because I will never be able to read Charles Dickens ever. He bores me and his writing's bad. So, yeah. And then I read The Sort of Knife by Philip Pullman, which is the second one of the His Dark Materials. And... I finished the shock of the fall this morning so what better to do than a quick review so in terms of the shock of the fall it follows a young man called Matt and he struggles with mental illness and with the death of his brother that happened like when he was a kid Um, what I loved most about this book was the characters and the dynamic of the character it was so real the like the banter, not the banter, but like the bickering between characters and his, like Matt's unwillingness to be his mum's baby boy was so well done and it was so believable, it was ridiculous, like I I, I would, could only dream of writing like that. Um, and what else like I really liked was there was no Hollywood grief, like, well I call it Hollywood grief, like you know when somebody dies, I don't know whether any of you have read these sort of books where somebody dies, and like they're all grief stricken for like a couple of pages and then you carry on reading the story and it's like as though it never happened and I kind of feel like it it damages the death for me I think that it ruins like the essence of the death for me whereas this you could feel that they've all been shattered by the grief of Matt losing his brother and them losing a son and it was it was just so well done like if you have to pick up this book like I, I think I sobbed all the way through it. It was so, 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 so good. And I also think that, like, in terms of a main character, Matt is one of the most believable characters that I've ever read. He embraces his flaws, so it's not kind of, I don't know, I don't know how to describe it. Like, he just, he's just believable, like, all the way through, you don't, like, he's consistent all the way through. Like, you don't think that, like, um he's suddenly going to change and I think that that's I've got right itchy eye hay fever season is back no um like you don't feel like you you know him by the end of the book kind of thing like I don't know what I'm saying it's such a good book I can't get words out because it's so good like like one of the ways that Nathan Filer has made him such a like consistently mentally ill person is like because it's told from his point of view so he'll be writing something like he's physically writing his story down and he'll be writing something and then halfway through writing it'll be like stop reading over my shoulder because the nurse is still behind him reading over his shoulder and it's like that those kind of things that make him like a real life person so it's it's like it, it becomes a real story like it becomes real life kind of thing rather than a book basically I just I would give this book 10 out of 10 and I would recommend anybody who hasn't read it to read it because it's fantastic like it is one of the best books I've ever read yeah yeah go read it go read it please please so I have somebody to talk about it with Okay, so that's it for today, guys. Like I said, if you want a full review on any of the books that I've read in my TBR, I have a City of Heavenly Fire review on my channel, which I will link down below. I also have a Shatter Me video review on my channel, which I will also link down below. And for all the rest of them, I have done a written blog post on my blog, obviously. No, Jordan, it's on the wall. No, <laughs> uh, a written blog post on my blog and i will link that down below but yeah thanks for watching guys like subscribe come back soon bye well i would say goodbye but the button's not working <laughs>